Yo, welcome to my channel. My name's Axel, and I am playing Lies of P Demo. It is a third-person Soulsborne game where you play as like a humanoid-looking Pinocchio, which is I'm pretty sure what the P in Lies of P stands for. And this is dropped today after the Summer Game Fest that I watched, and it was a pretty decent game show. I enjoyed a lot of the stuff that I saw there, and uh, this is one of the stuff that was shown, and I uh, can't wait to try it out. So let's play. Geppetto's puppet. We need your help. And here I am. Am I Pinocchio? I look way too human like. You have? Well, here I am. You found me. What now? I see they got Jiminy too. But we have to hurry. My name is Sophia. Please come to Hotel Crot and I'll explain what's happening. Jiminy, please escort him to the hotel. Hotel Krat. Minod's lamp. Do not be afraid even if you uh, bye bye. Did not read the rest of it. That was a lot of text. Let's get you out of there. Find something that might help. Like a sword or a cane or just some weapon to defend myself? Because this is a Supposedly, this is supposed to be like a pretty hard game. But the streets are not safe. Arm yourself with one of the weapons over there. It'll be helpful. Oopsie, I accidentally skipped that. Select the combat style. Now this I did not expect. Path of the Cricket, balance. Path of the Bastard, dexterity. Path of the Sweeper, strength. Balance of both dexterity and strength. Or should I go with dexterity only or strength only? I kind of like strength, but that kind of means you're going to be with a heavy weapon. So they're going to be a lot slower. And dexterity means weaker but faster. So let's go with um, balance. Damn, that was a cool sound effect. How do you swing? Like that. Like that. Alright. So far, pretty normal controls for uh, Soulsborne. Is there parrying? Let me try. Okay, that's blocking. I need to learn how to parry. There we go. Wow, I do a lot of damage for these basic enemies. I can punch, apparently. Is that like a counter? Welcome to Cross Station, everyone. Sawtooth Wheel. Use a pulse cell to recover HP. There's a maximum number of times pulse cells can be used. When you reach the maximum, the cell will be discharged. If you attack enemies while the cell is discharged, pulse cell will be gradually charged. If you attack enemies while the cell is discharged, pulse cell will be gradually charged. Okay. Gotcha. So how to use it. 
Up. X. Nice. I can heal myself. Enemy. Let's fight. Dim Ergo Fragment. Fable Catalyst. Use belt. Activate the upper belt slot. Activate the lower belt slot. Use the selected belt item. Hold down to activate the extra bag. Use item. Equip items and gestures on the extra bag to use them. Thank God, I know how to do emotes. What would I do without them? Let's do a little bit of healing. All better now. I wonder how much that heals, because that was pretty much almost my whole health. Wait, what was that? What do I need? Cart Central Station Main Entrance Key. That's a long title. How do you run? Come here, silly bugger. I got you, don't worry. I'm leaving nobody behind. I wonder how the boss fight is gonna be like. Has any of them been revealed yet? I don't remember. Rear fiddle attack from me from behind an enemy. That's pretty fatal. I'm not gonna lie, that looks pretty fatal to me. What's this? I thought this said virgin. VN line, to all parts of the world. What's that having stomping? Oh, there's someone there. Passengers note, if anyone finds this note, get out of this station and run. I am way ahead of you, man. Or woman. Whoever you are. Dash. While dashing, jump. Oh, you hold B to run. That's kind of odd. You jump like that. Got another Fable Catalyst. There you go. Ooh! Where'd Shikyu come from? Ergo's Life. Chamber of Machina Workshop. Or Machina Workshop? Machina? Krat Central Station. Dim Ergo Fragment. I'm getting a bunch of stuff that I don't know what it means. But they'll soon teach me, so doesn't really matter. Maybe not. My left arm can probably do something if it's charged up on the bottom bar. Lock device. There are doors and ladders all throughout Krat that are locked by devices. You can lock these doors or go down the ladders to create shortcuts. All right, typical Bloodborne fashion. Not Bloodborne. Well, I mean, any, um... Soulsborn. That's what I'm trying to say, not Bloodborn. Bloodborn is a Soulsborn, quite literally, because it was from the same developers. I was trying to do a sneak attack, but clearly you're anti sneak. No music? Nothing? Just silence?
Hold on, I need heal. Get back. I almost died. And I died. Already? That fast, huh? What did I say? Lie or die? I like in the bottom corner it says, now lying. And the nose is, it's growing and growing as the loading bar. That's really funny. One more time. Let's do this. You and me. One on one. Come here, I'm all here. Come on. Got him. And now you're dead. Crash Central Station main entrance key. I got it from you. Cause you suck. You definitely didn't kill me. Two, two, three, two times. Sawtooth wheel. Alright, just gotta go back to the entrance. That was locked. Okay, that one's locked permanently. I just wanna check. Wow, look at all this. Welcome to Kratz. It's a rainy night. A oh, horse. Poor animal. Repair the Stargazer. Is that like their, uh, this game's version of a, of a bonfire? Stargazer activated. Use the Stargazer to fully recover HP and stamina, as well as charge your pulse cells. You will, receive, you will revive at this point upon death. Remember, this process also revives enemies, not just your character, of course. Because why not? Welcome to the city of Kratz. In honor of... Oh, where'd you come from? Hello. Use to repair weapon durability. Oh, right, that's a thing. Grinder. You attack pretty quick. Please reduce 
as we are, we are not strong enough to beat the puppets. But if I lent my power to this stargazer for a moment... Gather ergo, clever one. This stargazer will make you stronger. Ergo, like XP? But the stargazer's strength doesn't last forever. So be careful with it. Hurry up and come to Hotel Krat. On my way, Sophia. Level up. What should I level up? What can I level up? Uh, vitality, nine, vigor, capacity, motivity. What does that do? Technique, advance. I should probably raise my stamina a little bit. Take down. Use a belt item. Can use a throwing object for a long range attack. Crack time issues 183. Got some more enemies over here. Can I sneak past them? I don't think so. Peace was never an option. Behind the back. Watch out. There's a man, -man with a sword. That's me. Oh no. The horror. The agony. There's a loose murderer on the streets. Oh boy! Who's gonna take care of him? I will commit suicide. Commit seppuku. Cause you know, I got a long sword, so it'll work out. I mean, is the seppuku a two person thing or like a solo thing? Cause whenever I see a media, it's like a two person thing. So I don't know if that's like always supposed to be that way. Probably is. I don't know much about culture, so I should shut the F up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't trust corners and like stacks of boxes when it comes to Soulsborne, because you know what they put behind them? They put bullshit attacks that are not your fault. Like, how am I supposed to know there is somebody invisible behind a corner? Huh? Like, seriously. Come here, I dare you. Ooh, that was a one-hit attack. Jeez, that was a close one. Unfair canine. Just assessing the situation here, looking around, making sure I don't get surprised. Clear ergo fragment. Wait, this ergo stuff that I'm collecting, is that like one of those things where I can like break it open and it'll give me XP? Obtain ergo 100. Yeah, it is. Obtain ergo 300. Oh, okay, so once I find the next stargazer, I'll uh, use some of that ergo. How do I go there? Can I go around this way? Oh, 
I just want to check just in case. You never know when you, unless you never know. Unless you never check. You never know. Yeah, it might be the other way around. Yeah, it's kind of weird that I can't jump over this small stone thingy. Fable Arts. Use Blade Fable Arts. While guarding, use, fa use Handle Fable Arts. Weapons have a distinct blade and handles that each have their own Fable Arts. Fable Arts use up Fable slots and different Fable Arts use a different number of slots. Charge Fable slots by attacking enemies with weapons. I already forgot the button for it. Oh, you're a big dude. Nope, nope. Nope, nope. Got him. Oh my gosh. God damn it, dude. Totally unfair. Oh, I found it. What is this? I got an urgent repair tool. Vinic Nils? Instantly repairs weapon durability. An emergency repair tool made by Vinigny. Vinigny immediately restores weapons durability. An emergency repair tool that Vinigny made to support stalkers. Regr regrettably, a manufacturing facility was destroyed during the puppet's occupation, so it has become a rare item. Okay, so it's like a one-time use. Let's go this way first. I just want to check if I explored everything before continuing. Oh, I got another thermite. Okay, there's nothing here. That's all I want to know. Let's keep going on. Fable Catalyst. You know what? I haven't taken time to just stand still and appreciate the the uh, area. Looks nice and gray. I like it. It's a typical day in UK. Does this lead to the first Stargazer? I mean, it's close enough. Yeah, it's like right there. Should I go do it? Yeah, might as well. A powerful parade puppet is blocking the entrance. And that's the only way in. Oh, it's a circus. Oh, please, be careful. What are you? Oh my gosh. Man, this boss is so hard, dude. Trying to time all the parries, all the dodges. Can I really not kill it? I guess not. What are you? 
What's up, man? Hello there. Welcome to Krat, visitor. Hi. I didn't think there were any stalkers left to fight the puppets. Well, here I am. You didn't. You ought to buy something while you're at the festival. You can't rely on yourself alone. Did you got any better weapons? Out here alone, you could use. Them. What you got for me, stranger? Oh, does he sell like the other, the other class weapons? I mean, I guess I can use them to like switch between weapons when I run out of durability. They all cost 300. What do I have? Uh, mine's called... I have the Puppet Saber Handle. Puppers, puppet Saber Blade. So I can switch out the handles and the blade. Let's see, I'll take the... How about the greatsword? There we go. Thank you, stranger. Introducing the puppet parade the parade puppet. Sorry got that mixed up somehow Parade Master, the first ever actual boss. Okay, switch your great sword. Hey, dude, what's up? Jesus, dude. What are you in there? Okay, phase two. What is that language in the bottom? Are those subtitles? Oh, I'm 
about to die. What's up, dude? I died. Yeah, it makes sense. It was my first try, you know, trying to get used to the moves and all that. I am back. Second attempt. Let's do this. Ooh, look at that. It's like a wall. I was so close. I was trying to back up, heal, and then do the charge attack right behind him. That was the plan. Yeah, it seems like my only nitpick so far is going to be like the whole weapon durability thing. And that sort of bothers some. But, you know, the whole point is to make it somewhat difficult in a sort of sense. And it's unique for uh, Soulsborne. You don't see a lot of games like that genre that has durability. That have the balls to do durability because that even adds like a whole new level of difficulty. Jesus, dude. Chill out. Almost there. I was so close. Look at the health bar. I was right there. For some reason, my attacks are not doing like the normal amount of damage and it's doing like less and less damage. Probably because it was low on durability. Maybe. I need to learn how to parry. That's like the most important part about this game. Okay, so far, good start. Oops, I forgot. There's a red attack. Gotta watch out for those. Shit, god damn it, dude. There we go, I finally did it. You're now dead. Eliminated. I got a parade leader's ergo in quartz. Special kind of ergo. Alright, that's all I need to know. Alright, see ya. So I wonder how long this demo is. It's gonna be like the per use. Usually a Soulsborne demo that I've played. I think you were like two bosses at least. Two, maybe three. If you're lucky, they give you like a really big chunk of uh, what the game has to offer. I 
Hey, look at that. I, I just noticed only half the durability of my sword was used on just that one boss fight alone. Which is not that bad. That's a pretty one good sword. Thing I should mention. The hotel security excludes puppets like you. So you'll have to lie to get inside. You're a special puppet after all. Oh, you mean Liza P. I'm the line puppet. Okay, I get your deal, Sophia. I know what you're ragging on about. What are all these? Dim Ergo Fragment. Hidden Moonstone. Okay, that was a lot of text that went away. Welcome to the sanctuary of the Grand Covenant. Prove your identity. Who are you? I'm a pup, a uh, human. Grand Covenant's fourth law. A puppet cannot lie. Welcome to Hotel Crot. So what would happen if I was being honest? Would they let me in? Like, oh, okay, you're honest. Come on in. Come on. Oh, was that the entire demo? Just one boss? I'm so happy to see you. I am Sophia. I've been waiting for you. Searched all over the city of Krat to find you. You must have questions. Geppetto will have answers. But we have to find him first. He was last seen on Elysian Boulevard. All of Krat is dangerous for humans. And that neighborhood is one of the scariest. Please find Geppetto on Elysian Boulevard. I'll explain more once you find him. Wait. Take this pocket watch. Krat is a labyrinth of peril right now. This watch will guide you to a safe place. Be careful, clever one. There I see you, Sophia. Moon phase pocket watch. Mystical powers, powers of something. Couldn't read the rest. Hey, who are you? Are you a robot? Welcome to Hotel Crop. My name is Polandina, butler to Lady Antonia. Please let me know how I may be of service. At Hotel Crot, comfort and calm walk hand in hand. Welcome to Hotel Crot. How may I be of service? Oh, what can I buy from you? Got any good weapons? Sawtooth wheel. Legion magazine. Fable catalyst. That'll be all, sir. Hello, old lady. Unexpected guests are welcome. We don't insist on reservations. I am Antonia, and this is my hotel. Welcome. Yo. Oh, I knew from the moment we met the George Petto's puppet. He did have a few loose screws, but Geppetto's skills are undiminished. 
a shame. He took off for Elysium Boulevard. And he never came back. If he doesn't turn up soon, we'll have to make a new coffin. <laughs> for my father, Geppetto? Oh, I forgot. I was keeping this for him. It comes with a long story. But I think it's better off with you. Please find that old man. And do take care of yourself out there. I will, thank you. Someone's memory. Shop clothes. Equip it on your belt or extra bag. I got a gesture. Is that all I got? What's this? Lightweight frame. Okay. Physical damage reduction rate. Hey, look at that. I look chipper. No accessories. Let's see. Krat Landmark. Guide 1. Alright, you know what? I feel like this might be a good place to end it there. It might be a longer demo than I thought it could be. Probably just one more I left, you know, one video half, another video another half. A little uh, tiny playthrough of, of a demo. I didn't expect it to be this long, but hey, it is what it is. And I'll see you next time for some more Liza P. Bye.